one of the contemporary examples of the need for collective bargaining is seen with CWA in their struggle with American Airlines when passenger service agents aren't making a living wage. I don't understand it because I pay so much for these American Airlines tickets. I wonder who the money is going to. I mean, would any American think that the passenger service agents aren't getting a fair wage given what we're paying in airline tickets? Yet the truth is many of those workers aren't getting a fair wage, particularly those who are working for Envoy and those who are working uh, with Piedmont. And there are many members of this House, 81 of us, who believe that American Airlines needs to do the right thing and pay a living wage. And CWA's ability to bargain, to ask for a fair wage for what all of us pay when we pay for tickets, to ask that the workers benefit from that as well, that's what is at stake in this Janus case. Can CWA organize and get a fair wage so that workers benefit?